These are ancient sea creatures called crinoids. Well, kinda. Anyway, these are the stems of ancient sea creatures called crinoids. This is a crinoid, but what is it? Crinoids are ancient echinoderms related to sea stars and sea urchins that first originated in the early Ordovician period, about 480 billion years ago. They are characterized by their long, stocky appearance and feathery arms, which they use to filter feed, catching like plankton and krill and whatnot. Not all crinoids are attached to the ground. Some, known as feather stars, are free-floating and use their arms to help navigate their watery environment. Today, there are about 650 living species of crinoid and over 5,000 known extinct species. Many of the extinct ones died off during the Permian-Triassic extinction event, otherwise known as the Great Dying, which also happens to be the worst extinction event in Earth's history, wiping out 95% of all life, primarily affecting aquatic species. Most of the time, crinoid fossils are typically the small little stem things that would have anchored them to the ground. However, complete ones, including the arms, can be fossilized and found. However, because their arms are made of a softer material than the stem, these are typically harder to find, making specimens like this comparatively rare and unique.